And when if you're so grateful for Christmas, it's not to say, I, I give Joneses a gift, they give me one back, I'll see what I got in the morning. <laughs> Won't you open up your heart and see what's in there? Find out what you got in here. Except if we find it empty with just negative creeds and, and, and cares of the world. Why not ask Christ to fill it tonight? Tonight. So that you can get the real meaning of Christmas. It, it's Christ in you. God dwelling in the human heart. That's what the real Christmas means. But you see, today we become so negative. It's the devil getting us to that. It's painted candy sticks and a, and a reindeer and, and a whiskered man that flies through the air like an airplane and visits the whole world and every home with a little fun of toys on his back and visits every child. And, and it's, it's just a lie. It's just right out of life. See? Now, see, but why? The devil did that so he could twist the minds of the people. The commercial world got into it, and they, well, they make it up through Christmas time until they can retire the rest of the year almost. I talked to a merchant the other day. He said, you give me these two weeks, and if I didn't have to keep my band here, I said, I'd wait till next Christmas. I could go fishing or whatever I want to do till next Christmas. He said, but I'd keep the boys going. They just keep here just enough, keep my business open, and it keeps, it keeps my hands paid off the things. Uh, I don't think that's until Christmas time comes on. You see, it's become a great commercial thing, but it ought to be a worship. Worship. Now, God is so anointed Jesus with the fullness of himself to, that he was God's gift to the world. That the wise men are clearly identified that their offering, their gift to him, showed that in their heart they knew who he was and what he was going to do for them. So no wonder the first thing they did, they fell down perfectly in order and worshipped him. Before they could even understand it, they fell down and worshipped it and then presented their gifts. That's the way to have real Christmas. Worship him, then present your gifts. Presenting your body as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to God. 